Vision 6 1, the legendary kingdom. Stop it, Pamela. We'll take it from here by ourselves. Thanks, Pamela. My pleasure. I'm glad to be of help. Klonoa, do be careful. Okay, I know. Okay, let's go, Hupo. What's the matter, Hupo? Um, it's nothing, Klonoa. Gaudius, his plans. We gotta put an end to it. Right. Hey guys, you you Kirby here with another episode of Klonoa. In the last episode, we did we explored the Sun Temple, well Temple of the Sun. We avenged Grandpa by defeating Jaka, but sadly, Gaudius was able to raise Crest Moon Kingdom, which we are now on. Today, we're going to chase after Gaudius. Now, this may or may not be the finale. You guys will know by the time by the time this uploads. But I don't know as of the beginning of this recording. By the way, you noticed that crystal in the background of that last area in the tunnel pool. This is what what that door connects to. Sadly, we cannot get past here. So what we have to do is we need to find the red crystal and go to that. We could go to the right, but that doesn't really lead to any much anywhere. So we have to go to the left. All right, so jump onto this. By the way, this is the these Vision Six is my very close second favorite vision. If Vision Three was not how it was, this would be my favorite vision. I always hate that. Ah, stupid birds! All right, yeah, but yeah. So if Vision Three was not what it was. This would be my favorite Vision. Okay, drop down. We have more armored guys this time on the ball. So what we have to do is not that crap. And I didn't realize you guys did. We need to use one of those guys to pop that. And now we air bullet the crystal, and those turn to dust, removing the red barriers of our way. Now there are three more. Yellow, blue, and green. Yellow is the final one we unlock. So over here we have this. So, because there's a red one, and we come out the lower side of that first crystal corridor. No, one thing I also do want to say about the music. Which is also very close second, second two. This day it gives the stage a som, uh, not somber, a sonic special stage feeling. Also, ghost are back. And as you see, we had that cl that cluster of birds. We cannot count. We have when we get the green crystal, we can get there. In fact, that is the way on the way back. Now, let's see if I can take out one of those, the one on the right. It's my middle. Cool. You see that guy all the way over there. So, try these platforms. But no, seriously. This would be a fair, would be my favorite stage. Just how beautiful it is. Just, oh my god, this is just so beautifully made. Even on even for a PS1 game. It's like, God, I love this stage and I love this song. Not as much as Vision 1's stage. As Vision, as, as Vision 4 1's stage. Anyway, there's the blue crystal. So now we can go along the blue path. I really like the, that piano rip. Just the do this this whole part of the song. Anyway, now we go to this. Now there's a blue there's a blue one and a yellow one on this one. There when we go inside, we have a yellow path. So when we break the yellow crystal, 
we can jump on these, but it's like there's no real point to going up there anyway, so might as well. But yeah, when we get break the yellow crystal, we can we can unlock that. So now we have this stupid thing. Yeah, more bombs. I want to say this is my least favorite part of this stage because it's like they have they had to use more bombs. It's like why the bombs? Crap. And there we go. Alright. So here comes the new thing. If hit by a Gordo enemy, those bombs will not will go off. So Yeah. Anyway, to the reason why I shot that one so early, that's the only way to get rid of that the one on this platform. Alright, so wait a minute. Crap. Crap. All right, so you need to. Oh, wait. Damn it. I have to wait for this to respawn. You need to shoot it so it re so it hits that Gordo to get rid of that one. There we go. To this path, hopefully we'll be getting a good. Made that without taking a hit. Alright, and there's the green crystal taken care of. Good, a heart. We would have preferred a four heart, but that's bad. Alright, so launch this. Have to real quickly launch hit that. Those guys respond. No wait, there's that. So now we have the green crystal open. Green crystal path opened. So we go back to here. Redo all this. Because. Eh. More music. And more beauty. And more ghosts. I swear, I love the ghosts. They just. They're derpy. They're, they're just derpy. Yeah, they just They're like derpy boos that don't know when you look at them and they don't know to to go hot to hide when you look at them. They are. That's what they are. Bye ghosts. Alrighty, so now we return to the original road. And we go back to that star row that we passed. And this time we go to the green totem door, the door that the green totem blocked. So now let us move along this. I really just love how shimmery sparkly this is. Just when you walk shimmers. That is really cool. Alright, so we end up in a boss run, but there's no boss. So, just hearts. And here we introduce to these platforms. The long, the long ones will disappear after a set time. Yeah, the emerald ones will disappear after a certain amount of time. The the sapphire ones disappear appear immediately. Now, now, so now, I know I said that three times. Okay, here's fourth. So now we platform with that stuff. Crap. There's the last puppet. Or innocent, whatever. Anyway, so now to unlock the yellow gem. Well, to hit the yellow gem. Oh, by the way, if you look closely, this is the same area that we start at in this area. That is really cool. Yeah, if you look really closely, that was the beginning of the stage. Anyway, lots of ghosts, so. Stupid ghosts. Alright, so now we have a bomb. Crap. I'm just gonna let you explode. Okay, so you go up. Okay, so you go up. There's that bomb. I wasn't 
wasn't really planning on taking advantage of the multiplier because. Alright, so now we return to the blue door because now we can go up. Yeah, so now we can go up to up this path. First of all, gems and then hard to, and then hard to miss heart. Climb up these sapphires. Dang it! Yeah, luckily, unlike that last that last sapphire path, if you fall here, you d you only just get set back at least like a few seconds. So better than lose a life. So now. We enter here, and that looks ominous. That's how I pronounce that word. All right, crack this silk crisp, normal crystal, and ride this platform to complete Vision Six One. And we get six more pup musicians. Now have one more stage to do. So one more part of that song. And now we shall move on to vision six to vision six two. The time of restoration. The prism corridor. The final vision. Hupo. Well, Hupo. final stage. Sir Hupo! Sir Hupo! Hupo. Oh, sire, we've been waiting for you. Our kingdom has been taken over by someone named Gaudius. What? We were careless. He trapped the feast into the egg below and is now pouring energy from nightmares inside it. Mother. Huh? If that egg's released, it will be disastrous for everyone. I understand. Mother, please keep out of harm's way. Mother? Shufpo, who are you? Shufpo. Klonoa, I'm really... Your father. I had to do that. I'm really the Prince of Crest, the Moon Kingdom. What? But, but... The Ring Spirit was my disguise. I had a reason to go into the outside world. Reason? I'm sorry. I can't say anything about that now. But I promise. I promise to tell you everything later. Hupo. I want you to just trust me. Just a little bit more. Can you help us a little bit more? Klonoa? Hupo. What are you talking about? We've been friends forever, right? Klonoa. Thank you. Shupo, you found yourself a fine friend. Yes, mother. <laughs> Let's go. Okay. Mother, please find somewhere safe. I want to say I love love the crest guards outfits. They look like little fucking marshmallows. Shupo, we're counting on you. Yes. And with that, we now have incentive to go through this final stage. This kind of loses its beautifulness. It's a nice stage, but it doesn't have the beautifulness of Vision 6-1. Yeah, so now we, yeah, so now let's ride up. Our hardest challenges lie in wait here. I have no idea what that text says, by the way. And now we have, now we're having, now we're in a little chase scene. 
We can actually grab these guys out of midair. We can. In fact, we actually have to. Damn it! I find it weird that that actually I think it's time that out. And now we have annoying, annoying puzzles to deal. With. Oh wait, not now. But in a little bit. Do you want pack for? And here we go. I think that's supposed to be Gaudius in that in that stained glass. And now we have Yeah, this sounds extremely sonic. This stage theme just sounds incredibly sonic. You cannot hear Sonic in this theme. It's like it does. 6-1 Sent had a little bit of Sonic. So now we have have boomerang guys. They're not bad. Alright, now we have a big shield guy. There we go. Jerk. Pop you. That's your punishment. For hurting me. Alright, so now we have to hit this. And that will move that block. That blocked our path. Nah. Alright, so now we can move down. I hope we come to some health soon, because now we're halfway through. Or a checkpoint would work. So at least we have a checkpoint. Alright. Annoying puzzle time! We have to hit all these. At the, have all these going at the same time. And I fucked it up. <sighs> there we go. Yeah, these are incredibly annoying. These are incredibly annoying. And there are multi there are at least three two of these. Two, three of these. So anyway, now we have a sand. I think that's to emulate the the um sandman. Anyway, now we're back in that first round area. So yes, complete each of those and we will come back to the this area. But yeah, so I think there are three of them. So, yeah. This is probably why I doubt this might be the finale. It might be, considering how well the boss fight for the stage goes. But you never know. So anyway, let's enter this next one. And more twinklings. So now we actually have to use in one of these. Damn you. Good. I got one of you. Ah, crap. That's why I don't like really thin platforms. It, I'm not a fan of thin platforming. It's, it's cheap in my eyes. Crap. Good, yeah, I got you. Yeah, I was just going to grab that puppet. No, no, I'm not. I was going to try. So now we have another. Alright. Alright, so we need to inflate the big one and bounce off him. Yeah, seriously, I think in the stained glass windows of these shrine areas, I think that's supposed to be Gaudius. Crap. Yeah, I think that's supposed to be Gaudius. Are you kidding me? Uh, oh, now you come back. I inflate you. I can get back on that platform. Yeah, yeah, he will not. Yeah, that one because you actually need to use him. He will not drop gems, and I took a hit because. Uh, all right, so now we need to time this perfectly. Life. Don't need that. All right. Heart.
and gems. We need the heart more than five gems, so. Sorry, Jim. So, sorry. So, sorry, heart. I'm just five gem. Sorry, five gem. The, the heart was way more important than you. So, now we have a. Yes, now we have a armored mill. This guy will drop gems, though. Yeah, this guy will drop gems. Anyway, now we need to go hit another another switch. Alright, so we need to wait. This. I think I. Yep, made that. Crap. Crap. Yeah, what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to grab grab the move as you land. Cool. Got it. And so that will remove that. So now we can go on. But yeah. So yeah. Last stage. We were we were here once before with Spyro, but that was a lot longer. But this is a lot longer. And now we have a double puzzle. All right. Okay. I. Oh wait. No. You need to use this one too. Uh, pop. Egg. Oh right. Yeah. Now I remember. I'm supposed to use. I'm supposed to use that one. There we go. Yeah, that one's a little bit easier once you actually realize what you're supposed to do, cause, cause the the first one did not have a moving shield guy. So now ride the sand path. I always jump because I get a little nervous for that, so forget the jumping. All right, so now we return to the to this section. We don't need that ha that big heart though, so that's a good thing because we're full health. So anyway, now we move on, move past the red and the blue and the green. I was gonna say green. All right, so now we move on to the dark blue path. And this one, we already yeah. All right. Crap! 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 Yes, made that. Yeah. Not going to try again because I just, yeah, big set those scary. Oh look, it's the mini Rangabangas. But sadly, that bird is right. Is dang egg. Yeah, to get yeah, we need to get rid of them in order to pass. All right. So now, luckily, with with that first one gone, we don't need to put ourselves in danger. There we go. So now, go on to this for more springy shield guys. There, finally I get you. For this one we actually needed to time that. Now we have another big Ragabanga. We'll take this boomerang guy, because we need to time we need to get onto this platform and use that big use that spring guy to do it. To get rid of it. There goes that big Ragabanga. Now we have a shield guy who's blocking the last puppet of the game. And pop goes that. So now we need to get, take this guy and hit that button. Bam. And that last block is moved. So now we can do the last of the puzzles. I really don't like those puzzles, by the way. <laughs> the I'm, n I'm not a big fan of time switch puzzles. So right now we have this little path to do. Ah, crap. Crap!
For that, let's hope we can get that one. Yeah, it's best to get when the platform is as close to these guys as possible. Got you. There we go. Jump down for hearts. And last puzzle. This one is super annoying. Alright, so... Damn it, we're, damn it, we've missed it. We've, we've fucked up already. Alright, wait for both of those to come back. There. Good. That uh, top one is going down. Yeah, the first one was really annoying. The second and third, the third one, the second one is kind of the most easiest, and the first one, I mean, the third one is 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 in the middle, honestly. So anyway, we ride this platform back, and we have made it. Ride this platform up. We'll grab that the big heart along the way because we have finished the stage. All that's left is the boss fight. And just by the time, yep, we'll be doing a phantasm situation here. All right, this is the final path. Here's a boss fountain. Heart, life, heart. Enter here. And we float. <laughs> Oh, uh, we just float. We floating. Soon, soon, the nightmare crystal will, uh, crystal Nahatun, Nahatun will be ready. But what is this dream? A dream that cannot be corrupted by nightmares. It must be removed. It must be eliminated. For the creation of the perfect Nahatu. A vision of traveler of foolish dreams. How amusing. I did not anticipate you following me all the way here. Gaudius! <laughs> Looks like you are a little too late though. Why are you doing this? Why? I am tired of this foolish world that neglects nightmares. And relies only on good dreams. This is reason enough. What gives you the right to do this? When not in the is unleashed, you'll be erased too. It doesn't matter. I've already been abandoned by the world. This time, it's my turn to throw the world away. No! Never! Very well. Meet your doom! And now we begin to battle Gaudius. Takes place on this circular platform. These will warp us to another. St will warp us on side the platform. So we have to avoid touching these because I don't think you can hit him in on that route. He'll send out moves, bubbles. You have to dodge the ones. You also have, yeah, yeah. You also have to grab them. Oh, right. Right now, I remember. Yeah, you can only hit him with swap with warping, by warping. So we need to grab a moo and head to the nearest warp. But well, flipper. Damn it! I warped. Damn it! I warped. 
damn it. Yeah, Gaius is a lot harder than Chaka, but he's the big bad guy, so it's not, it's understandable that he's hard. Alright, so we have to, dang it, stupid bubble. Go, 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 yes! Oh, oh, you have to avoid those at all costs, oh. It's been a while since I fought Gaius, so yeah. Oh, right, yeah, that big, the big cape is his hit point. Here's his hitbox. Derp. See? You actually can hit him multiple times. Times of that attack. Yeah. Too bad I learned it when I had one heart. Big heart left. See? Yeah. Got him twice. So now he'll turn into three heads. The three head attack. I think they changed his attacks. Alright, so now he has three crystals. So now, shit bounces. On the plus side, it's easier to get moves. On the downside, it's easy to get knocked into the other side. To flip. Just like that, I was almost flipped, and he has two more hits left. Hey, but I have one, so let's judge how. So now it's time to see how good I am. Uh oh. Ah, crap, this one. I think you can only grab it from. Oh, you just launched it. Come on, grab two. One. Bam! Got him. Got him. Vision 6-2 completed. Man, that was good. And no cutscene. And that is the full song. We have completed all the stages. We have one more thing to do. But sadly, that will be next time. Yes, I am doing another Phantasm. The finale and bonus will be one episode. Next time, we'll tackle the final vision and the bonus.